तो स्वाद है फिर से आपको आपने अच्छा में टेक्निक आज की डेट बहुत ज़्यादा इंटरेस्टिंग होने वाली है एज यू ऑन वट वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टूडे अबाउट प्रूव डेट इन अंडर एनी थिंग इज इन नंबर दिस इज फ्रॉम चैप्टर नेशन नंबर वेरी फर्स्ट फ्रॉम द बुक एन सी आर टी ओके द चैप्टर नेम इज The chapter's name is real number. Real number. And which question that I have right here, you are going to get this notes of each question. Notes of each question. we are going to do today two or three questions in which i am going to make you totally understood this topic okay that questions will be uh, will <coughs> in the type of presentation in the type of presentation presentation you will you will get the link of it in description box in description box okay link aapko available ho jayega description box mein theek hai without wasting a time let's start today's video after a wow type of intro and amazing intro let's start today's video arises what that prove that root 3 is irrational number prove what we have to prove that root 3 is what irrational number okay now we will get solution and then we have to let root 3 be a irrational number okay First, we suppose root three as a rational number. Okay, okay. The uh, you have known, you have, we have studied in class ninth that we can write, uh, we can express a rational number in the form of p by q. Then p by q is equal to root three. Is it? Yeah. Then what? Squaring both sides. Squaring both sides. P square upon Q square is equal to under three ka square means three. Okay, okay. So what we can write P square? P square is equal to three Q square. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Or three Q square is equal to P square. Okay. Then from here we have to, uh, we have said that Q square is equal to P square upon three. Then here, three is the divisible of p square. Hence, three is also the divisible of p. Okay. Now what we have to do? Let P square is equal to how much the value will be in this? We have to write is equal to three and any constant we have to take k, okay? K. P is equal to k. Let P is equal to k, okay? P is equal to k. And now putting here, okay? Now putting here and what will happen? Three Q square is equal to in the uh, uh, place of P we have to write three k is equal to three k. Square okay. The three q square is equal to nine k square. Yeah. Then q square is equal. Uh, then what? Three uh, q square is equal to nine k square. The k square is equal to three q square upon nine. One upon three q square upon three. Is it? Yeah. From here we have to get that three is. Also, the divisible of 
ovo. E já vamos aqui, aqui ver. P, N, Q, R, co-prime numbers. Co-prime numbers. Co-prime is what? I like prime. Okay. Then 3 is also the usual of Q square. Then 3 will also divide Q. That we have read in earlier classes that a prime number have only one factor. But here uh, 3 is 2 factors. So this is not a prime number and this is not a, a rational number also. Then we have get that ki root 3 is not a rational number. So this contradiction, this contradicts. Contradicts means, contradicts means what? Nakar dena. Avoid. Okay. This contradicts our fact that prime numbers have only one factor okay yeah so hence root 3 is an irrational number you will feel some guilty but you have to write these all steps to get a few marks to or uh, three okay this is so important topic in class 10th okay you will practice two or three times this will be in your habit okay you have to write each and every step if you miss a single step now you are able you are able to deduct your marks You are able to make the checker to deduct your marks. You are able to make the checker to deduct your marks. Okay, so don't be ever that like. Okay, yeah. So this is the first question. If you don't understand, let's do one more sum. Second question is what? Uh, the second sum is what? Sir, sum means what? Sum is nothing but problems problems are questions nothing to worry about okay the solution will be what prove that 3 plus 2 root 5 is an irrational number okay okay good so what you have to done in that is that let or suppose Suppose 3 plus 2 root 5 is a rational number. Okay. Is a rational number. Then what will we hear? In rational number we can express it in the form of P upon Q. The P upon Q is equal to 3 plus 2 root 5. 3 is also a rational number. The P upon a Q by transferring here minus 3 is equal to 2 root 2 is also rational so here it is will multiply and here it will, it will come to then it will become divide 1 upon 2 p upon q minus 3 is equal to root 5 yeah by multiplying this p upon 2 q minus 3 upon 2 is equal to root 5 is it yeah is it yeah then what will be here we know that p upon q where p and q are rational numbers okay 
तो P in Q is rational number. Hence, hence what this thing? P upon two Q minus three upon two is also a rational number. Okay, yeah. Are you agreeing with till here? Yeah, you should. Then what will be? We have to write some statements that what this contradiction, this contradiction has arisen. Because difference of difference of two rational. numbers is always irrational but here it is Irrational. Yeah. In this question, the thing will be given that where root five is irrational. Okay. If it it will not given, then you have to prove that root five is irrational in this. Okay. Then what? Then the last step comes that, hence, hence, then uh, writing it upper, hence, three plus two root five is a rational, uh, sorry, irrational. number yeah yes so itna step to karna padega bhaiya and this you have to write this properly that as i written <laughs> you have to learn this okay you have to learn this uh, this will i will give you in pdf i will give you in pdf so Okay, now moving towards the our last sum. Now moving towards today's last question. The today's last sum is what? Six plus two plus two root five. Most children are confused here. That what is will be here? Six plus two plus two root five. You have to nothing to confuse here. You have to add this both terms. Okay, so the what will be your solution? Solution will be that let. Eight plus two root five is a is a rational number. At a, a rational number, we can express it in the form of p by q. Uh, p by q is equal to eight plus two root five. Because eight is a rational number, we will transfer it to here. Then p upon q minus eight is equal to two root five, and two is also a rational number. So transferring two also to here, then one upon two p upon q minus eight is equal to root five. Okay. I hope till here you can understood all the things that I want to. Uh, Understood you make you understood. Then from here, P, uh, we are always aware. Uh, I am always uh, leaving a step that here will be where P 
पी एंड क्यू आर रेशनल नंबर्स यू हैव टू राइट दिस दिस इज कंपलसरी देन व्हाट विल बी हियर पी अपॉन क्यू इज अ रेशनल नंबर पी अपॉन क्यू इज अ रेशनल नंबर या because from the upper line where p and q are rational numbers we can understood that p upon q is a rational number okay then what if p upon q is a rational number then 1 upon 2 p upon q minus 8 will also be a rational number will also be a rational number then a contradiction will be then the contradiction is what the contradiction has arisen that the difference difference of two rational numbers are always rational but in this case that is irrational from irrational from where you have come to know that the root 5 is rational because the question is saying that where root 5 is rational yeah yeah then what hence hence 6 plus 2 plus 2 root 5 is irrational number or 8 plus 2 root 5 is irrational number okay that's all for today if you love this video like this video comment on this video share this video and if you are new on my channel please get to subscribe and press the bell icon because i made such interesting videos regularly so let's end today's video here and that's all for today